All right, we're doing another low water swimming area. We're gonna hit where we can. There's still a huge ice berm here. There's my first good target. Got me a dime. Don't even really have to dig for this one. There's another dime. So that's good. We got some fresh drops. I've hammered this in years past, so this is gonna be mostly a fresh drop hunt. I'm hoping someone dropped a gold ring last year. Well, I think that's the first time I've ever found a horse. I don't know. I actually did find a huge lead horse one time. Forgot about that. All right. First quarter. Got a penny I didn't show you. Well, that was right next to the quarter, so that must be a spill. Nickel. Quarter. So I've been getting a lot more clad than I've been showing you and a lot more pull tabs. But this is pretty cleaned out. I did a pretty good job. But you can see all these coins are fresh. So, hey, where there's clad, there's jewelry. Let's see what we can get. Holy cow. I can't believe what I'm seeing here. Is that gold? That feels too light to be gold. Dang. Ah. Uh, Cool though. A ring's a ring, right? All right, I got some sort of pendant here. More bling. Hey, this is a good sign. I haven't been here very long. I already got a ring and a pendant. Well, I think that might be ring number two. Yeah, there's just trash. But I can't tell. Might just be trash. Yeah, let me check it out. Maybe it's got a mark on the inside. All right, so this is definitely a ring. It's got a mark on the inside. I think it's sterling, but the mark is really weird. It looks like it says nine heart <laughs> six five. <laughs> so I don't know. I will do some testing though. And let you know but i'm pretty sure that's gonna be sterling we've been battling clad all day he finally got a buffalo he got a buffalo boom looks like it dropped pretty far and we're scrounging around on what i like to call silver dollar beach it has been hunted like crazy we probably won't find anything but we brought our small coils we're hoping the waves change the rocks a little. I did get a suspender button already, but look at that. Look at that crazy old can opener. Isn't that awesome? That's definitely some treasure. Look at that thing. We can open up a can of beans or something later. Now that's an old hook. Look at that thing. That's from uh, People who used to try to snag fish. Huh, I wonder when that became illegal. That's pretty cool though. <clears throat> I was getting a nice high tone next to these boulders. And it's a license plate. Let's open it together. Let's see what we got. So, not that old. <laughs> oh. So Dinwiddie's been doing so terrible that I hid my can opener so he could find it. Yeah. Did you hide this one too? <laughs> <laughs> we can open, open bottles and cans now. Well, mine actually had the little knife thing sticking yeah, out, I know. so mine's obviously nicer than yours. No, so you won. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely beating Dinwiddie now. I just sniped a nickel. Look at that. Well, that just proves I am terrible at metal detecting. Because this place I thought was cleaned out. <laughs> We're in it now, baby. There's a dime. So, obviously this isn't the goal. We're trying to get something old or, you know, a cool piece of jewelry. But hey, I'm impressed for finding anything. Well, I wish I would have filmed that, but I... 
was hearing like big iron and I was like, well, let me just dig it up, see what it is. And then I dug it up and there was a quarter next to it. Yeah, sometimes if you just <laughs> dig those big things up, it'll unmask something else. I just pulled a weedy. See if we can get a year off this sucker. Looks like it's going to be a 1953. This is what happens when you trash talk Dinwiddie too mad, I guess. He starts finding stuff. He says he's got silver. Fifty-nine. Dang. Hey. Silver, second, silver. Second one. I'll so, take it. Second one of the year, or second? Sec second one of the year. Third one I've got. Nice. Yeah. So we're getting a few things out of here still. Yeah. There you go.